Welcome to Sky's Animal Adventures, the Halloween edition. We have a zoo to ourselves. First, we're going to look at the penguin. That looks like that one's the king. Is that the king penguin? <laughs> Can I tell you a fact about penguins? Yeah. Did you know the small type of penguin? I think it's a penguin. I'm not sure. It looks like over there, there's facts about penguins. Alright, maybe we should go check it out. Look at this guy, he's curious. Hey, little curious penguin. <laughs> Let's go. So here's all the different penguin types. There he goes. That, did you know penguins swim really fast? Here you can get a good view up here. I'll get video of you, okay? There you go. Penguins don't like hot water. Since they get too hot, they more like cold and chilly water. It's really cold in here and can get we're only up to 30 degrees in here sometimes. Good fact. It's, it's way cold in here. It's glass. Cold can pass through glass. Did you know that? Cold can pass through glass? Uh-huh. Should we keep going and see, uh, let's see, what is, what's this guy called? He looks like he is uh, half asleep, maybe. Fish, I would call them brain fish. They kind of look like a brain since they kind of have wrinkles. What's that brain fish? It looks like a eel. Yeah. We better not touch the glass if it's touching it. Or else it might be electric eel and it will get electrocuted. <laughs> <laughs> now here. Oh, yeah, these things really look alien, don't they? Yeah. Look truly alien. It looks like this is a shrimp here. This little long nose fish, not what sure, not sure what his name is. Alright. And here's some it looks like tropical fish. Do you want to tell everyone what you are for Halloween this year? Hermione Granger from Harry Potter. Yep, sure are. Uh, algae and like coral is actually made out of these really tiny animals and they're actually different colored than it actually is. This type of uh, substance makes it their color like blue, green, yellow, and maybe orange. Alright, so next I think we enter the tropical beaches section, right Sky? Their skeleton decoration, yeah. huh? Hey, look! <laughs> I think that's definitely a Halloween decoration. What do you yeah. think? Maybe you should do a Halloween scavenger hunt to see if we can find Hall five Halloween stuff. Okay. Ooh, this one's always my favorite. It's like fish and trees. Totally. Ooh, now here we come to the tunnel part. Uh -huh. Our favorite. You might even get to see a shark. Hey, I see one.
Do you know any shark facts, Sky? Or maybe a couple different species of sharks? Uh-huh. There's a basking shark. It kind of looks like its mouth is like a plastic bag. Speaking of bags, you got your trick-or-treat bag there, huh? Hey, I think I see a puffer fish. Or that must be a sea turtle. It looked in that's a little Yeah, I do see a sea turtle up there. Did you know they have powerful jaws? Turtles do? Really powerful jaws. Weird. That must be did you know one time we've been above the aquarium? We got a behind the scenes tour and we got to finish. I was so little though, I can't barely even remember. Yeah, I think you were in your stroller when we had that behind the scenes uh, tour. Ooh, there's a shark right there actually. They must keep him well fed, otherwise he'd be attacking the other fish, right? Oh, here comes another one. Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. Do you think they're scary or majestic? Majestic. Don't be scared since some have got ripped off probably by sharks, but they don't get hurt. They're so Ooh, jellyfish. Okay, let's come over here and show them this jellyfish. These are South American sea needles. The South American sea needle is found off the coast of South America. Their scientific names come from the Greek word Pocomus, meaning wings of hair. Thanks, Guy. Ooh. I guess we're going this way. What are these called? Upside down jellyfish. Because they're upside down looking, huh? That's too scientific, I guess. Too scientific, indeed. This is my oh, your favorite part? Let's go see your favorite part. My favorite part. You can see. Did you know you can actually see jellyfish's brains? I see the like pink, almost flower-shaped stuff. That's their brain. Uh huh. Here's a close view there. Now, are these dangerous to people? Really? Is there any animals that can eat jellyfish though? I'm not sure. I think some species of yeah. sea turtle can, maybe, but not all of them. They're really dangerous and they can steam, but they aren't trying to hurt you. They just have steamers to kill their prey when they can eat. Well, let's wrap this up by showing them the uh, the thing that you step on, the motion-activated uh, kind of dance floor. Or maybe we can show the end where of the Amazon. You want to go all the way through? Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at this big guy. Here's a big sea turtle. It's like a... Wow, really beautiful, huh? Yeah. You want to show them how the dance floor works? Yeah. You want a boogie? So you have to try to step over the bridge like this. And then you have to step over the bridge. Alright, now we'll make our way this way. 
Oh yeah, this is beautiful. This is one of my favorites. Look at that fish. Look at those colors. Wow. These are so beautiful. Do you have a favorite, Sky? Probably all of them. That's a good choice. We have the zoo relatively to ourselves. It's a special Halloween event that just opened, so it's like 1% uh, as busy as it usually is. Oh yeah, you're right. It is a hammerhead. And there's a steam race. Don't want to get steam by a steam ray. <laughs> oh, they're so beautiful. Looking. They actually don't steam. They're really friendly. Oh, he said hi to you. Hi. <laughs> okay, let's go. Alright, you lead the way. Uh, the pleco and the paku. I think the paku is, uh, I think it's a form of piranha. I could be mistaken. Don't quote me on that. Yeah. We haven't done our research. This is kind of a raw, unrehearsed, unscripted Sky's Animal Adventures. So you're getting us Here. just a regular old tour, making it up as we go. A little part broke off there. Look at these big guys, they're like gentle giants. what the Amazon looks like a little. Would you stay overnight in the Amazon for a million dollars? Only if I had a thousand armies with me. <laughs> All right, this concludes our tour. Do you want to say anything mm -hmm. to wrap it up? We might have more videos soon. Sorry that we didn't make some over the summer. Just we didn't really have time when we were doing other fun stuff. Bye.